Hi, Richard Yost here for Birdhouse Spy Cam. I'm occasionally asked how hard it is to set up and connect our Hawkeye Nature Cam or install it in a birdhouse. The answer is it couldn't be easier. It took nearly a year and a half of development and tweaking to make the Hawkeye a simple, easy to use camera. Simply hang it where wanted, run the cable inside, plug it into a TV or computer, and then sit back and be ready for some real surprises. Here's how. Although we make every effort to assure all parts are included in your Hawkeye Nature Cam package, take a brief inventory, making certain the camera, power adapter, small bag of cable clips and instructions are there. Tools you will likely need to mount the Hawkeye, whether in a birdhouse or near a feeder, include a large and small Phillips screwdriver and hammer. First, loosen the small set screw beneath the camera lens so it can be adjusted as needed. Don't over twist. It only takes a revolution or two to go from extreme close-up, like your fingerprint, out to infinity. The next order of business is to make certain the camera works, especially before going to the trouble of mounting it outside or in a birdhouse. It's as easy as can be. Simply uncoil the length of the 100 foot cable, plug the power adapter into an outlet, and plug the red power adapter plug into the red plug on the camera cable, and then plug the yellow video and white audio plugs in the, into the TV RCA jacks. Turn on the TV and make certain it is on one of the auxiliary channels. Now let's look at mounting the camera in a birdhouse. Remove the top. and Many birdhouses have sides that swing out for easy cleaning. Make certain you mount the camera on the opposite side so it won't block the swinging side. Next, partially screw in the mounting screw into the top hole of the camera bracket and then mount in the upper corner of the birdhouse. Be sure to place it about a quarter of an inch or so uh, away from the side and then make certain the camera is far enough down so the roof won't bump into it. Notice how the camera can swing back and forth a little bit and move up and down. Next, attach the cable to the back and uh, sides of the birdhouse with the black plastic mounting clips that come with the camera. Now, put the top back on and you're ready to go. Either use your hand Phillips screwdriver or if you have an electric drill with a Phillips head on it, that makes it all the more faster. Now just hang the birdhouse. Run the wire into the television, plug it in as we showed you earlier with the power adapter plugging into a wall outlet and the yellow, make certain you get the yellow plug into the yellow jack on the television and the white one into the white jack and you're ready to go. Sit back and be ready for some real entertainment when the birds move in.